solve 1 by x plus 1 by x plus 1 greater than 0. Hello friends, welcome back, hearty welcome to you. Let us look at this problem. We have to solve this inequality. 1 by x plus 1 by x plus 1 greater than 0. Now how to solve that? We know that this function becomes undefined whenever x is 0 or x is minus 1. Now let us try to simplify this function or we will try to restructure this function. So for that we will take LCM. We will have x plus x plus 1 divided by x into x plus 1 greater than 0 that will give us 2x plus 1 divided by x into x plus 1 greater than 0. Now I don't want to have this denominator part. I want to change this function into a function where there is no denominator part. So basically I want to multiply with something so that this will go away. Then that should be nothing but x square into x plus 1 whole square we need to multiply. So I will multiply the function on both sides with x square into x plus 1 whole square and see what happens. Now I will have 2a in 2x plus 1 divided by x into x plus 1. Let us simplify this. When we simplify we will have 2x plus 1, x will go x times, this will go 1 time. So 2x plus 1 into x plus 1 into x greater than 0 into anything is 0 only. So the function became 2x plus 1 into x plus 1 into x greater than 0. Now based on this, let us try to understand what are the critical points. The critical points are the points when the function will become equal to 0. Let us understand them. Let us take them individually and try to equate them to 0. One is 2x plus 1 equals to 0. Another is x plus 1 equals to 0. Another is x equals to 0. So from the first one we get 2x plus 1 is 0. That means x is minus 1 by 2. x plus 1 equals to 0. That means x is minus 1 and x equals to 0. That means x equals to 0. Now let us take the number line and try to divide that. Let us take the number line. and divide this into we have minus infinity to infinity. Let us come from small value to big value. So, I will have minus 1 then I will have 0 in between I have minus 1 by 2. Now, these are the sections how intervals how number line is divided. Now we have to understand out of this which interval will be our solution set. Solution for our inequality. So let us go ahead and substitute the values from each interval. Let us take a value. Let us say between 0 to infinity I will take value 2. Substitute 2 in this in this particular function. 2x plus 1 2 into 2 plus 1 that is 5 into 2 plus 1 that is 3 into 2 which is greater than 0 that is perfectly correct. So we know that then this is correct. Then by method of intervals we know that then this is wrong. This is correct and this is wrong but we will cross check this one by one. We have checked the interval 0 to infinity. So let us check values between minus 1 by 2 to 0. Let us take a value between minus 1 by 2 to 0. So for that I will take minus 1 by 4. If I substitute minus 1 by 4, 2 into minus 1 by 4 is minus 1 by 2. Minus 1 by 2 plus 1 into minus 1 by 4 plus 1. Multiply that with minus 1 by 4. Now 1 minus 1 by 2 is 1 by 2, 1 minus 1 by 4 is 3 by 4 and minus 1 by 4. Positive into negative, this is less than 0, that means that is wrong. 
now similarly you can check for the next section also you can check between minus 1 to minus 1 by 2 let us take a value there also let's take a sample value we will say that value is minus 3 by 4 I think that is between minus 1 by 2 and minus 1 let's substitute that 2 into minus 3 by 4 that is minus 3 by 2 plus 1 into minus 3 by 4 plus 1 multiply with minus 3 by 4 we have now minus 1 by 2 multiply with 1 by 4 multiply with minus 3 by 4 and this is greater than 0 because minus into minus is plus so we have seen that minus 1 to between minus 1 and minus 1 by 2 excluding the boundaries we have function this linear in equation holds good similarly we can check for between minus infinity to minus 1 any value we can take and we can check that there it is negative not greater than 0 we can check that also let's take some value here minus 2 i will take in that scenario 2 into minus 2 plus 1 that is minus 3 into minus 2 plus 1 that is minus 1 into minus 2 minus into minus into minus is less than 0 but what we need is greater than 0 so where the function is holding where the linear inequality is positive is between 0 to infinity and minus 1 to 1 by 2 so let's write down our solution this is our solution our solution is minus 1 less than x less than minus 1 by 2 or x is greater than 0 x is greater than 0 is representing this interval and minus 1 less than x less than minus 1 by 2 is represented by this interval so the solution of 1 by x plus 1 by x plus 1 greater than 0 is minus 1 less than x less than minus 1 by 2 or x greater than 0